Okay, hello Aries. This is Queen of Pinnacle Sarah 333. I'm here to do your video. Um, my email address is monique5380 at gmail.com and I'm here to do your video. So let me see. I'm going to start with these. All right, Aries. Moon sign, sun sign, the Venus sign. This is a video for Aries. All right, Aries. Somebody could have been dealing with a Pisces, but I see secrets. Um, secrets, probably lies, deception, division. And I'm doing love today, so it could be secrets in this love um, situation. But it could be secret feelings of how they feel about you, too. Because I see somebody thinking about you at the same time. If it ain't you, it's the other person thinking about you. Or you thinking about them. Either way. Um, this person really thinking about you, and they're thinking about... Yeah, probably a secret relationship that y'all have. But if not, somebody got secrets and lies and deception going on. Uh, but anyway, this whoever it is, they're thinking about you. Or you thinking about them. Man or woman, woman or man, man or man, woman or woman, man or woman. Either way. But I see you being victorious at this. I see you succeeding at this situation. And, you know, following your heart probably too. Taking a leap of faith with this person. Somebody could be dealing with an Aries or a Pisces. Um, could be anybody though, but they want to take a leap of faith with you or you want to take a leap of faith with them. But anyway, let me see. Could be someone in this situation who drink a little bit, but anyway, I see your wish coming true in this situation. You know, I see you taking a leap of faith and going with your heart, following your dreams too. In this love situation, um, I see you being victorious at it. This person is thinking about you. You know, before there could have been secrets, lies, and deception, but they thinking about you. They thinking about it now. Whoever it is, somebody thinking about also the choices that they need to make, what path they need to choose, which way they need to go. You know, so you know you've been trying to be strong. Somebody could have been dealing with a uh, Sagittarius, but you're trying to be patient with this person. You know, things moving slow though. You know, things ain't moving fast enough. But I see messages. I see communication, um, traveling towards you. Even, it could be moving slow, though, so I ain't no telling when it's going to get there, but it's coming. You know, whoever thinking about you, you know, they're thinking about messaging you. They're thinking about communicating with you. This person could live at a distance, but not for everybody, but for someone. This is a general message. It may relate to some people, but not to everybody, but that's what it is. Okay? Y'all thinking about each other, though. And if somebody did something wrong in this situation with the secrets and lies and stuff, this person is stressed out about it. It's stressed out to the point that somebody out there probably having a couple of drinks, probably a little bit, many, too many drinks. But now they want a new beginning with you. Could have been dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, but don't have to be. Could be anybody. Could be a Sagittarius or Aries or a Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. I see all signs or Pisces. But anyway, this person felt a deep commitment to you. They, you know, they felt very connected to you. Y'all had a chemistry thing going on. Y'all had, y'all had some love going on, real love. That was either you or the other person that was left crying. Could have even been a breakup, but didn't have to be. Could have been, though, because somebody did move on. Or somebody, if you didn't move on, you were thinking about it. You was really thinking about moving on. Let me see what pull these. Let me see what they tell us. Okay. Now, you're looking good to that person, and they looking good to you. But there was a lot of passion here. But on top of that passion, you could have broke that person's heart or they broke your heart. But there was some kind of passionate situation. Mm, I hope it didn't lead to a broken heart. Somebody probably found out somebody was sneaky, though. Uh huh. Now, whoever this person is, they're stressing about it. And they want to take a leap of faith with you. They're trying to make a choice now. They're trying to figure out which way they should go now, you know. Hmm. This person, you know, marriage was probably offered to you or the other person. But now they're probably thinking about this marriage and they're thinking about this commitment. Could have been somebody you was already married to. Could have been somebody you was already committed to. Could have been somebody that you were even living with. They were happy with you. If you thought they wasn't, they was. They probably had a little sneaky energy, though, but they were happy with you. Now they got to make a decision. Cause I got the two of cups, the two of one. Oh, yeah, two, two, two. That's what I got. Now, you know, they want to get together with you, probably even get back together with you. But I said somebody could have been dealing with some kind of addictions, drinking, smoking weed or something like that. Not for everybody, but somebody was. But anyway, this person was happy with you. You could have been dealing with a Leo or you could have been dealing with another Taurus or Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces or Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. But, 
You know, they was happy with you, but somebody in the situation was let down, stabbed in the back, not treated right about the situation, you know, just not treated right by the situation, you know, but this person could have been somebody you was married to, even somebody you probably could have wanted to marry. Now they want to offer you something after they let you down. They want to give you something. Let's see. What, they want to give you a new beginning. They want to give you a new beginning. It could be a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Sure could. I see two Ace of Pentacles. Somebody could out there could also, if you think your finances are not great at this moment, I see someone's finances um, improving. Not for everybody, but for somebody. But anyway, not for everybody, but for somebody. But I see. Someone want to offer something to you. They want to offer something to you, but it, somebody feel like it's small. This person was let down, you know. This person had felt like, you know, you crushed them. They felt like you smushed them. Like, you know, you de you destroyed them. I mean, not for everybody, but for somebody did. Somebody was let down in this situation or, you know, at one time, not, you know. If it didn't happen, it probably will, you know. But now they want to offer something to you and they want a new beginning. This person is your soulmate. Now, somebody in this situation was left feeling like, you know, all is lost in a breakup. You know, they were happy with you. Now they want a new beginning with you, you know. This person want to get back together with you. If y'all broke up, they want to get back together with you. If y'all ain't got together yet, they want to get with you, okay. So there's a decision that need to be made. There's a, several decisions that need to be made. Somebody got to make their mind up, but it's a hard decision because somebody probably dealt with someone that was sneaky in the past. If they haven't, if you already did, you probably already did, but, you know, somebody was sneaky. Somebody had a sneaky energy, though, yeah. Now they want to come towards you. They want to travel towards you. They want you to take a leap of faith with them or they want to take a leap of faith with you. Not for everybody, but somebody, you know, they got to keep this a secret, you know. Probably because somebody out there is already married. Uh-huh. Okay, but I see a completion of a happy family. This person will be happy with you or you'll be happy with them. Okay. Now they want to offer you something. Now, if they let you down, I see you turning your head. If they let you down, I see you turning your head to them. I mean, they want a new beginning, though. If, if, you know, if if you wasn't married to this person, this person probably want to marry you now. I mean, but I see a broken heart here on the table. Somebody was suffering from some broken heart. If they heart, if you, I mean, if this person didn't break your heart, you probably had suffered from a broken heart in the past. They find you very beautiful. Now, whoever you're dealing with, they find you very sexy, gorgeous, attract, attractive, passionate, fiery, beautiful. They want to move on. They probably won't move on, though. I mean, there's somebody that probably did move on. Whoever did, nah, they have a new beginning with you. They want a new beginning with you. You know, they're trying to be patient, though. They ain't saying nothing. They moving slow, you know? Somebody ain't moving fast enough for somebody out there. But now I see messages traveling towards you. Whoever it is, they probably live at a distance. But, you know, I feel like you got to make a choice. And you'll be that wish come true. This new beginning, I mean, it's beautiful out there. I mean, I see the sun shining on this. Not for everybody, but for somebody, you know, the sun is shining. But secrets, lies, and deception. Now this person thinking about you, you thinking about them. Uh huh. And if they were sneaky, if they didn't do you right, they stressing. They stressing about it. Uh mm huh. -hmm. But I see triumph, victory, and success for you. So whichever way you go, you're going to be victorious at it. Okay, whatever path you choose, you're going to have victory in that too. Now, but there is somebody out there who moved on or wanted to move on. If they didn't move on, they moved on. And if, if you did move on for someone in this in a relationship, they feel let down by it now. And they feeling like stressed out about it a little bit too. Okay, I'm going to use these. About this love. Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius could want a new beginning with you, you know. They want to start something. They want, to, they want things to grow, you know. And they want to work on this now. You know, they want to travel towards you and work on this too. And if you owe an apology, this person want to come in and apologize to you because they probably did something wrong, you know, because I did see the ten of swords, which means that somebody was let down in this situation. That's not for everybody. General message, man and woman, woman and man, man and man, woman and woman, or man and woman. You complete them, they complete you. And they sitting on top of the rainbow thinking about you now. I mean, they all in the clouds thinking about you. And if they did you wrong, they thinking about how they was a snake to you too. But 
you would have been, they would have been happy with you if you were happy with them. I mean, could have been somebody in this relationship, though, um, wearing a false mask, you know, not treating the other one right, you know. Somebody was dealing with the devil energy, you know, chained down, something that holds you down. There's something that held somebody down because... Not for everybody, but for somebody did move on, I mean. But this person feel trapped with you. And if you're in love, or if you're just in love, you know, they feel trapped with you in love, too. Like, they're obsessed over you. Tempted over you. You make them happy. You know, they, you put a smile on that person's face, you know. Yep. Yep, could have been dealing with a Capricorn, too. Uh -huh. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. Now they want to offer love to you. But I feel like somebody probably going to turn down this love offer. Not for everybody, but somebody is going to turn it away. Because somebody felt like, you know, they was tired. I mean, this was draining them. You know, it was a lot. But this person is charging for it. Want to come for it. I mean, this person coming in fast. I mean, not for everybody, but for somebody. This person going to come in fast because you made them happy. Even that, even if they let you down, now they want a new beginning. Could have been dealing with a cancer. Okay. This person, uh, one of these persons, you know, very man or woman, caring, loving, giving, beautiful, like to fix up. You know, this person could like to decorate, you know, had like a soft spirit. Now they want to come in and offer something to you. And I feel like they want to give you something too. What do they want to give you? I see an offer in here. They want to give you love. And they want a new beginning too. Oh, the queen of cups and the king of cups. This was a soulmate. Even if they let you down, this was a soulmate. And yeah, I said they were going to offer you an apology. They sure is. They want to come in now. And if you're single, this person been flirting with you. You see them. And they see you too. Y'all probably live at a distance. But it's like I can't reach you. And they want to reach you. Now they want to reach you. They want to reach you. That's what I hear. I feel like too. Somebody could have been dealing with. Um, it's an age difference in this too. Could be a Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Pisces. Or Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I see all signs or Virgo. But this person now, you know, they want to offer you love for real. I mean, if they owe you an apology, they want to come in and apologize. Offer you love. Uh-huh, they do. This person is very generous, too. Give a lot. They probably gave a lot in this relationship. Somebody gave a lot in this relationship. Sure did. <sighs> they, they find you very beautiful or you find them very, very, very beautiful. You know, you're looking real good, you know, people right now anyway, because you you look very attractive. But I feel like something was going on, though. Somebody felt like stuck, trapped in a situation they didn't want to be in either. Not for everybody, but for somebody. You know, somebody had them feeling like, you know, trapped. I mean, they were trying to go around it. Well, at least they didn't fall in it. They didn't fall in Somebody didn't fall that trap. Somebody, didn't, somebody felt like they were going to fall for a trap, and they didn't. <laughs> they didn't. They was like, I ain't falling for that. Because they didn't know whether they could trust the other person. Because this person probably already been through a whole bunch of stuff. So, you know, they work hard and stuff. They feel like, you know, I work too hard to fall in this trap again. I, ain't, I mean, I ain't falling in this trap. So somebody didn't, somebody, like, somebody accepted the love. And somebody's like, I'm not falling for it. They're trying to get far away from it as they can. I mean, somebody running from love. That's what I see. But anyway, um, but you know what? It'd be completion of stability, uh, completion of a happy home. Somebody want to show you something. Somebody want to give you something. Somebody want to take care of you. You know, not for everybody, but somebody do. You know, I ain't telling you to fall for it or nothing. So this, I'm just telling you what the cards say. This is the story I'm getting. But I see somebody probably went ghost on somebody too. Not for everybody, but somebody did ghost them. Somebody got ghosted, you know. They probably were scared of that love, and they ghosted it because it was strong. So I see an offering given to you. Somebody thinking that, you know, 
I want to give you a chance. I mean, somebody may give this person a chance to somebody just reaching their hand up like I can give you everything. I mean, I do. I mean, I see love. I see a lot of love in this spread today. Uh -huh. Yeah. So. Okay, but somebody out there, not everybody, but somebody feeling like I'm good. Somebody out there trying to do me, like I'm doing me right now. I hear I'm doing me. So even though, you know, this person feel you very attractive, trying to offer someone love out there and they want a new beginning with you. Somebody feeling like I'm starting to feel like I'm good in this. I mean, just like I'm good. Like, you know, they, you know, they planted their seeds. They tried to work on it anyway, you know. They, But that was something that didn't work out. I mean, for, not for everybody, but for somebody, probably because that sneaky energy sitting there, that somebody felt let down by the situation. Somebody felt like they gobbled them up. I mean, that let's love gobbled them up. I mean, now they running from it. I said they was running from it. Now, somebody felt like treated wrong in this situation. It was a burden. It was a burden. That was a burden in love. Now... Somebody holding the other person up and, and they want to help them. They want to they want to come in and give them something. I mean, they want to help them. They want to they want to help you alone now. Even if they did you wrong, they want to help you alone now. I mean, they're trying to carry you. They're trying to carry you. They, you know, before they probably ate you up. I mean, they probably did you wrong and stuff. But so you felt trapped in love. But now they want to carry you out of this and. But that was something that didn't work out for someone. Not for everybody, but for somebody, it wasn't. This person, you know, drowned the other person, you know. This person was reaching up for you to help them, and you were just looking down at that person. I mean, not you, but it could be you or the other person. It could be you or the other person. Now they want to offer love to you after they felt like, after you was reaching up and you was trying to give it to them, but they... They weren't taking it. They were just looking down at you while you were drowning in love. But now they got to make a choice, you know. Now they want a new beginning, you know, because they did you wrong. They did you wrong. Somebody found out about lies. A home that's built on fancy foundation had crumbled and fell down. And this had, this had, this was a burden. And they was your soulmate. Even somebody out there probably was left crying. The other person was sneaky. Somebody weeping was a snake. But now somebody got a choice to choose. Somebody got a choice to make. They thinking about you, you thinking about them, and if they was if they were sneaking, they worried, they stressing, they stressing. You had them on your mind sometime, but at least you ain't stressing. But whoever watching this video, y'all know who I'm talking to. Now this person wanna move forward. They wanna message you, they wanna communicate to you, you know what I'm saying? Now they wanna offer you love. They wanna talk to you, they wanna communicate with you. Now they want a new beginning. Now they wanna make a choice. Now they wanna choose the path from which they should take. Really? 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 Okay. Okay. Um, oh, I'm pulling, I'm pulling in. So let me see what the love angels have to say about this situation. I mean, and if you got a cat at home, and if you let your cat outside, please um watch your cat. Watch your cat. Because it's something around there after your cat. But you deserve love. You are lovable. If you thought you weren't lovable, if you thought you didn't deserve love, or you felt like giving up on love, you do deserve love. You're lovable. What else? Just watch your cat because, I, I mean, for some reason my eyes got drawn to that. And just watch your cat. So somebody in this situation is healing their family issues. You know, your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. So you got to forgive your parents, forgive everybody 